All my lead code experts and DSA masters, I need y'all to help me out. Is the time complexity of string comparison big O of N, linear time, or is it big O of one constant time? What behind the scenes is the programming language having to do as far as time complexity to compare a string to say whether a string is equal or not? I asked this on social media and I got a lot of mixed results. I asked ChatGPT, I got one result. I asked LeetCode, I got a similar result. And both of those said that it's big O of N or linear time. But a lot of people on the internet were saying they think that it's constant time or big O of one. I'm gonna give my opinion too though. ChatGPT says it's big O of N where N is the length of the shorter string being compared. Which to me that seems weird because if you have the, if the links are different, then you can just check the length of the strings in constant time and then the operation is constant. Eco says, and this is part of a bigger problem, but if you see inside of here, it has a words equals word, but it's inside of a loop. So they're basically saying the loop is in and M is this thing inside of the loop where you're doing a string comparison. And it's saying M is the total length of two input words. The number of operations you're doing is, you know, one for one in each in each character of each word, not each word altogether, if that makes sense. Personally, what I think is that it's big O of N because in the best case, if the strings are different lengths, then you just need to use the length of the strings. You can, you can check that first. You can say, are the links the same or not? If they're not, then you can check that in linear time because usually the length in most programming languages is a linear operation to just get the length of a string. You compare the lengths, if they're different, then you know the strings are different. You can break out of your algorithm in linear time. But we know big O notation works off of worst case. In the worst case, the strings are the same length and every character now needs to be checked individually to make sure the strings are the same or different. So you think about the word moss and the word most. If you want to know those strings are different programmatically, you need to check M, O, S, and then finally at the end, you see that S and T don't match in most and most. If the words are equal in length, then you have to check characters one by one and the programming language behind the scenes have to do it. Now, yes, some programming languages can optimize this further, but we're just talking in the sense of big old notation and just in general logically because of that i think worst case this whole algorithm together you check the links first and then if they're the same length then you have to check every character worst case you have all the strings that you're comparing are the same length and you have to check every character big old notation goes by worst case so that would make it big o of n or linear time complexity for the whole algorithm altogether, not just part of it this is what i'm feeling y'all let me know what y'all think